दिस इज़ अ न्यू एक्सरसाइज इन ऑटोडेस्क इन्वेंटर फ्लैंज पाइप विथ रिब नाउ यू विल सी नोट ऑल डायमेंशन आर इन मिलीमीटर मटीरियल कास्ट आइन ना फर्स्ट वी विल मेक दिस सेंटर पाइप यू विल सी डायमेंशन थ्री हंड्रेड बाई थ्री हंड्रेड कॉर्नर रेडियस आर वन फिफ्टी मिलीमीटर एंड इफ यू सी द डायमीटर ऑफ पाइप हियर यू विल सी इंटरनल डायमीटर नाइन्टी एंड थिकनेस फाइव सो फाइव प्लस फाइव टेन टेन प्लस नाइन्टी हंड्रेड मिलीमीटर सो लेट्स डू दिस फर्स्ट नाउ हियर आई एम गोइंग टू सेलेक्ट न्यू and go to template and here choose metric and you will see this template because our drawing in millimeter so is standard millimeter dot ipt create now let me expand origin and here we, you have to select any one plane so i am going to select xy plane and you will see this symbol create activated just click and activate create sketch okay now here i am going to select line now let's start from here 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 press escape key to out now look these lines are not perfect so i am going to select horizontal you will see right click okay now it seems vertical activate here constraint equal i am going to select these two right click okay now activate dimension and apply any dimension this one going to be 300 mm okay now activate here fillet and keep 150 mm and let me select these two lines and you will see here simply exit now this is fully constrained sketch finish now i want to create one circle at this part so better to create circle at this part so let's check which plane this is going to be xz plane is sketch now activate here circle now if i move cursor it becomes green means this is coincide now click and drag 100 mm enter now press escape key to out finish sketch this is fully defined sketch now activate here sweep feature okay by default this circle selected here profile path you have to it is activated you will see in red and simply choose path look behavior orientation follow path the simple way we don't need to make any twist or taper so keep as it is here you can name this body so i am going to keep as it is say okay now see our first body created now go to shell feature shell now first you have to choose inside outside or both side i am going to make inside so keep here inside now faces remove so select this face press and hold shift key and press middle mouse and just rotate and select this now here make thickness 5 mm now see you will see the preview if you activate this enable disable preview see so always keep enable say okay look here now let's make this flange thickness 20 mm and you will see internal radius 90 this outside radius 60 30 this radius this inside diameter 30 for 80 80 so let's do this in both side now i am going to select this face you will see this symbol here one symbol called edit create sketch or create finish so sketch okay now let's do one thing i am going to design here 60 radius into 2 120 now here also 30 into 2 30 into 2 press escape key to out now let me do one thing i am going to connect with this line now 
press escape key to out now select these two lines and here one option called construction see activate equal again vertical this is already vertical make click this line and all are vertical press escape key to out okay now let me activate line tool now click here somewhere and move cursor press escape key to out now let me activate tangent select this one and this one this is going to be tangent select this line and this this is going to be tangent okay now i am going to here choose mirror select this line mirror line activate mirror line and choose this line apply see here done now the same thing we will do for bottom but for doing this let me apply dimension dimension from here to here it's 80 mm see that's fine again activate line and start one middle press escape key to out again right click on this line and you can select construction mirror now first we have to choose these two lines now activate mirror line so i am going to select this line apply you will see the preview done circle now at center 30 enter 30 enter press escape key to out now here come here project curve and select this one escape key to out now select uh, coincide select this center point and this center point see this is how it is moved right click okay okay now let's activate trim now i am going to keep cursor over edge and click left and this is going to trim see just click with left mouse and this is going to be trimmed press escape key to out let's apply one more dimension from here to here 80 accept it now it seems our drawing is fully defined it's uh, difficult to find what exactly balance so we will go with this finish sketch and activate here extruded feature now first you have to choose close profile so i'm going to select this one see here profile selected sketch also selected because we are started from this face now this is moving in direction behavior you will see direction default 20 output in boolean we are going to keep join rest as it is okay now just rotate the model now just click on this sketch okay now either we can copy this uh, previous sketch but we are going to create let's start from here 60 into 2 okay this is also going to be 30 into 2 60 let's apply line and start from here to here press escape key to out and select these two lines press and hold shift key right click construction this is important line activate line connect from here to here press escape key to out now here apply constraint tangent select this line and this curve this line and this curve press escape key to out now again i am going to apply here mirror first you have to select the things which is going to mirror 
and select the mirror line so I'm going to select this line apply you will see done again I am going to activate okay before going to apply mirror let's apply some dimension to this eighty eighty millimeter press coincident relation and uh, we have to choose center point S now here choose concentric relation select this circle and this circle that's fine mirror now I am going to select the sketch planes or uh, entities which is going to mirror so select these three mirror line there is one line okay selected apply you will see the preview done circle and I am going to apply a few important 30 press escape key to out now here choose equal and select these two circles okay let's rotate something so that we will get the idea what's wrong anything wrong in this okay let's apply trim now see if I move my cursor over it's going to be dotted line so simply click with left mouse and delete so simply I am going to do for all this extra line so that we will get a complete close profile there are now many close profile just because of line press right click ok that's fine ok radius is not defined I believe sixty ok still the point is not defined so select here coincide select this point and this point ok again I am going to define this radius ok it's uh, going to be fine I believe all the dimensions are given we don't need to define ok if you want to define just uh, do this accept it now simply finish and activate extrude feature now here we have one close profile see if I move cursor and click and see these close profile selected see here profile and sketch both selected behavior default 20 millimeter thickness output boolean join because we are going to join a new body ok now let's make one rib this rib depth also 20 millimeter 95 millimeter from here 95 millimeter from here so I am going to select here X Y plane create a sketch activate line tool and just select the bottom line to here press escape key to out smart dimension select this end point and this 95 and I am going to select from outside to point 95 this it seems fully constrained finish sketch now activate here now activate rib now first here you have to choose parallel to sketch or normal to sketch I am going to select parallel to sketch let me choose profile now it still not appear here means you have to change direction see this is direction 2 this is direction 1 I am going to select direction 1 you will see here just hold and shift key and you will rotate the model and you will see the preview thickness 20 millimeter now here you have to choose thickness in both side see and here also you have to select 2 next so this is going to extrude up to this circular body preview in enable disable ok now material I am going to apply from here cast iron 
आई होप यू लाइक इट डोंट फर्गेट टू शेयर लाइक और वीडियो एंड प्लीज सब्सक्राइब आर चैनल फॉर मोर वीडियो एंड मोर प्रोजेक्ट्स इन सॉलिड वर्क एंड ऑटोडेस्क इन्वेंट्रो थैंक्स फॉर वॉचिंग